recession sent the market tumbling today, but what does that mean for you, your home, your finances? Erica Engel got answers from an expert for a story that's new at 10. Erica? Recession is a scary word, so we spoke with Carl Bonham, executive director of the UH Economic Research Organization. We asked him how most of us who live paycheck to paycheck might be able to recession-proof our finances. Buying things is fun, but economists believe a recession is coming. According to a new survey from Charles Schwab, nearly 60% of adults live paycheck to paycheck. Bonham says a U.S. recession could be six months to two years away, but the sky is not falling. So, the, you know, no reason to panic at this point, um, but be, you know, be prepared as best possible. Uh, so you think about the biggest risk to uh, a household when a recession does arrive, and that is loss of income, loss of job, right? And so anything that you can do for job security obviously is the best place to start. But it's not always possible to prevent job loss or a reduction of your work hours. And so a key is, is to not have accumulated too much debt, right? And to have, you know, have your, try and have your expenses as best as you can within reach and in control. An employed student with his own apartment, Rexford Cahill learned the importance of saving up from a very low point in his young life. I was homeless actually uh, three years ago. So I lost, I had to literally lose everything for me to realize that I was making mistakes. And I came back up, I got a job, got an apartment, joined school, and I learned that life isn't free. Cahill buys and resells items online for extra cash. Online surveys and working as a secret shopper can also earn extra money. His advice? Every paycheck I get, I put half of my rent away in my savings besides what I need to save so that I have to not worry about my bills. We can take some comfort because Bonham says we're not looking at a fall off the cliff situation like in 2008 and 9, but we could be looking at an extended period of slow growth. Back to you.